Yeah, I don't know if you could describe kind of how people have been in your interactions with them. Like, how do they, how much do they want to listen to what a door to door candidate has to say? It's really interesting, you know, as a first time candidate and an immigrant who was also familiar with a different political system before moving here. I was 16 when I moved here. So it's really fascinating to observe how people behave at the doors. I mean, it, I mean, the reality is most people actually don't open. So, you know, the sample size significantly shrinks then, right? But uh, for those that do open um, the doors, many are actually pretty, um, you know, they're not, they are really not paying too, too much attention just yet about municipal uh, politics because of the federal election that just concluded. And also because there's a bit of um, confusion in, um, you know, what municipal governments actually do because there's less... Uh, drama about it uh, when it comes to the news cycle, if that makes sense. Mm-hmm. For totally. those that, um, so sometimes when I have to ask, when I ask questions, I actually prompt them by listing out the different things that the city does, you know, and the questions about transit, property taxes, snow clearing, garbage, libraries, police, and sometimes that prompts uh, questions. Um, so there's a lot of questions uh, I get about, um, you know, taxes, property taxes, um, spending or feeling that they're not getting their value out of it. Um, depending on the neighborhood here in CP Wilnawak, um, we all of us, most of us here on the West End just got our garbage bins. So it's a bit of a learning curve. And I've been getting some uh, um, complaints and concerns about that. It becomes an educational opportunity. I tell them that. If you have a seven plus person household, you can order a bigger bin and they're like, what? Or, you know, like this is actually how the schedule works and get really informative um, for them. Uh, Transit is a big one, especially since about four to five neighborhoods here in the ward are now um, going through the pilot project of the on-demand bus system. Um, Just like my neighborhood, half of my transit trips are now in the um, on-demand bus system. Um, some had mentioned uh, c- concerns about accessibility, snow clearing, and uh, you know, just making sure that every every single like infrastructure in our community, a person in a wheelchair can actually get to. The answer is hardly no, it's not the case at all. It's remarkable how many steps or stairs are in every house, but you know, that's a I'll I'll, I'll rant about that another day. 